often hot and dry on the road before you get into Cane River country, dry and flat. That doesn't mean you can speed along, though, especially through Powhatan, listed in travel guides as a speed trap, a spider in the I'm desert. The I'm the bad man set up there. That's right. They call it a, a speed trap town. In this sleepy town, you can glimpse a fading Louisiana tradition. We don't have any empirical data, but there just don't seem to be as many enclaves of men content to sit in the shade beside the road and talk. In Powhatan, they apparently still do, waving at all the few cars all the live long day. We'll pass through pretty Natchitoches without stopping just this once, because it's Sunday morning in Cane River country, and that's when the baptizing is done. Shall we gather at the river? If you should hear an old spiritual from a crowd of people dressed in white by the side of the road, you really should stop. You should see it the way they used to do it, another baptism in the Cane River. The way they used to do it is still the way they do it here. Prepare ye the way of the Lord, yeah. make it path straight. Yeah. Uh, you see, uh, that was a man called by God, yeah. and his name was John the Baptist. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, his father's name uh, was uh, Zachariah, yeah. and his mama's name was Elizabeth. Yeah. Uh, you see, uh, John was a forerunner uh, uh, for Jesus. Yeah. See, uh, John was preaching a repentance. Yeah. Hey, uh, in order for you to be saved, you got to acknowledge who your Savior are. Yeah. Uh, uh, see, uh, right. baptism is okay in the eyesight of the Father. Yeah. Uh, see, because uh, baptism is essential to the essential. Yeah. See, uh, I'm glad to be in uh, uh, this number this morning. Yeah. Uh, this is an old-fashioned revival. People have gone away from this old-time revival. And it symbolized how Jesus was baptized. We know people like to come to the river where they can get together and sing and praise the Lord. Pastor Murphy Randolph of St. Augustine Baptist Church in Melrose recites the passage again as generations here have. Jesus came to the river Jordan. Upon your professor, sister, in the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, I indeed baptize thee. Yes. In the name of the Father, yes. and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. That's all right. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Thirteen souls for Jesus are ready to be washed in the water this morning as if the long traditions of religious renewal and spiritual cleansing aren't enough there is another moving tradition being replayed here if you believe tonight yeah. can this look and feel much different than a cane river baptism of a hundred two hundred years ago eighty one year old willie may tenars was baptized near here and in this way in nineteen twenty eight well, the Lord, you know, you know, when he went down to the river of Jordan, he told John to baptize me. John said, I don't feel worthy to stoop down and unlatch the shoe. But he said, suffer to be so. And, and when he buried him in the water, he said, the spirit descended up on his shoulder in the shape of a dove. He said, this is my beloved son in whom I'm well pleased. So that was the answer to that. Thirteen souls for Jesus have come this morning to be washed right now. in yes. their Savior's blood yes. and the waters of the Cane River. Yes. Ambrose Williams yes. is ready. In my mind, in my heart, being baptized and being born again, to be a child of the Lord, that's making me feel good. And to all my relatives, blood, and people, 
they encouraged me, led me on in church. They stood by me. And that would make me feel so good, you know, to be cared about somebody and by the end of your life into the hand of the Lord. That's what I got in my thought right today. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Yes, sir. It made a difference in my heart. It took all the burden. My heart was heavy. It lightened my heart. It made my heart more lighted. All the time that I was living, I was living with my heart so heavy. It was fear in my heart. And I had to go to the Lord Jesus in order to lighten my heart and see the light again. This is a tradition we're told happens less often now that churches have indoor pools. So when you see a family of believers gathered by the side of the road, gathered at the river, you'd best stop to see it and be refreshed yourself. I guess more out of it on the riverbank than I do at a pool. Why? Because it's the old way to do it? The old way. I was up when you John was down there judging baptized and Jesus went down there and I just loved that. I love to do it the way Jesus did it. Lost Louisiana will continue down the road less traveled.